Welcome to the Blue Coat Proxy SG First Steps video tutorial. This tutorial describes how to filter content by web application and or specific operations done within a web application. For example, you can create policy to allow users to access all social networking sites except for Facebook, or block access to all social networking sites except for LinkedIn, allow users to post comments and chat in Facebook but block uploading of pictures. Prevent the uploading of videos to YouTube, but allow all other YouTube operations, such as viewing videos. Also, you can block access to some videos according to the Videos YouTube category. Allow users to access their personal email accounts, but prevent them from sending email attachments. To control web applications and operations, complete the following steps. Configure Bluecoat Web Filter. Set web services such as external HTTP and HTTPS to intercept. Decide which web applications and operations you want to control. Create policy and test the policy. In addition, you can view the application mix report. The following slides will demonstrate these steps. To control access to websites and web applications, you need to enable Bluecoat Web Filter and download the database. First, confirm that you have a Proxy Edition license, not a Mach 5 license. The license name appears in the banner of the Management Console. To enable Bluecoat Web Filter, in the Management Console, select Configuration, Content Filtering, General. Select the checkbox in the Enable column and click Apply. To download the Bluecoat Web Filter database, select Configuration, Content Filtering, Bluecoat Web Filter. If you have registered your appliance, the URL should appear in the URL text field. Click Download Now. You can check the progress of the download by clicking View Download Status. This solution assumes that you have HTTP and or HTTPS services set to intercept. To do this, in the Management Console, select Configuration, Services, Proxy Services. Under Predefined Service Groups, expand the Standard Group. Locate the service you want to set to intercept. From the drop-down menu next to the service, select Intercept. Decide which web applications and operations you want to control. For a list of supported web applications, see Bluecoat's Site Review website. The web applications are grouped by type, such as audio video clips, email, games, news media, and so on. Clicking on a web application name displays a pop-up with a description of the application and a list of supported operations. To allow and deny access to web applications and operations, create policy rules in a web access layer. First, launch the Visual Policy Manager. In the Management Console, select Configuration, Policy, Visual Policy Manager. Click Launch. Next, add a web access layer. Select Policy, Add Web Access Layer. Right-click the Destination column within the rule and select Set. To control web applications, click New and select Request URL Application. In the new window that opens, select the checkbox of the applications you want to control and click OK. To control web operations, click New and select Request URL Operation. In the Supporting Application list, select the web applications you want to control. Select the checkbox of the operations you want to control. Click OK. Set the action to allow or deny depending on the policy you want to create. And click Install Policy. The following example demonstrates how to add a policy for controlling YouTube operations. 
With this policy, users will not be able to post messages or upload videos in the YouTube application. All other operations will be allowed. First, add a web access layer. Name the layer YouTube Controls. Right-click the Destination column within the rule and select Set. Click New and select Request URL Application. In the Application list, scroll down and select the YouTube checkbox. In the Name field, enter a descriptive name such as YouTube App and click OK. Now add an object to deny post messages and upload video operations on YouTube. Click New and select Request URL Operation. Under the Supporting Application pull-down menu, select YouTube. Select the operations you want to block, post messages, and upload videos. Name this object YouTube Operations. Click OK. Now create a combined object. Click New and select Combine Destination Object. Add YouTube App to the upper right box and add YouTube Operations to the lower right box. This ensures that both conditions must match for this policy to deny requests. Make sure the action is set to Deny. Install the policy. To verify the full policy details on the Proxy SG and the VPM, click View current SG Appliance policy files. Now users can play videos on YouTube but are blocked from uploading videos. The Application Mix report shows a breakdown of the web applications running on the network. This report can give you visibility into which web applications users are accessing, the amount of bandwidth these applications are consuming, and how much bandwidth is gained by optimization of web applications over different time periods. Select Statistics, Application Details, Application Mix. Select a time period from the Duration drop-down list. The pie chart displays data for the seven applications with the most traffic during the selected time period. The unidentified slice includes traffic for which the URL is not a web application. To learn more about the most effective ways of deploying and using a Proxy SG appliance to secure your network, visit the Bluecoat Proxy SG First Steps web guide, available at Bluetouch online. For comments or suggestions on this tutorial, Contact us at training.books at bluecoat.com.